one of the questions that uh, is often asked of us is, what do we do about those who've left? If I have, mm-hmm. a, if if I had a church with attendance of two hundred and it's cut in half to a hundred, do I go find? Do I spend my time trying to reach the hundred who left, or do I work on maybe more of a new Great Commission emphasis to those who have never attended? Mm-hmm. Now, here's something you need to the church leaders need to realize. If your attendance went from 200 to 100, you didn't lose 100 people. They're not gone. Mm. Some Mm. are. But remember, Mm. a significant number of them are just attending less frequently. So one of the things is you're not going after people who are not there anymore. You are trying to ask the question, how do I get them more committed than they were? So that's that, you know, that's that's question number one. What do we do about those who have gone? Mm -hmm. Question number two, what do we do about those who aren't here at all? Well, over 91% of churches in America in our last study at Church Answers, over 91% of our churches had no significant emphasis on Great Commission obedience at all during mm-hmm. the course of a year. Mm-hmm. So yeah. if nine out of 10 churches are not trying to reach people with the gospel, there's probably a good chance that they aren't going to be reached with the gospel. Now, that is yeah. so profound. I know that that's yeah. just one of the most profound statements that I can make, but that's the reality churches have gotten uh, inwardly focused, Mm -hmm. more focused on me, myself, and I than looking beyond the doors of the church. Here's here's one thing we, we, we encourage all churches to do. First thing is, do you really know your community? Do you Mm. really know who is your community? We have a resource called know your community, same name. Mm. And one of the things we say is uh, tell us, for example, uh, what is a typical drive time to your church? If you if you were hmm. to include 80% of all people who are in your church on a regular basis, what would be their drive time? Not the outliers. And typically, it may be different in a populated area like San Diego, but typically it's about a 15-minute drive time. And mm-hmm. so we say, who's in that drive time? Okay, right. what are the needs? What are the psychographics? How can we reach them? The question becomes, how can we reach our community? So that's one of the next yeah. questions we ask.